Ta-da! Not sure about the whole spinning chair intro. I've seen many other YouTubers do it, thought I'd give it a go. Don't know if it's for me. Anyway, it's kind of fitting because I am talking about YouTubers today. In fact, I am gonna talk about photography YouTubers. In the last, probably, what, six to 12 months, I've noticed a increase in the number of photography vloggers or YouTubers. And I don't know if that's because I'm looking at it more or if it's because there just is more. I think there is just more. Uh, and there's a few that really dominate when it comes to subscribers, but there's a few that I don't think have the number of subscribers that they should. So what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna go through 10 YouTube photography vloggers that I think you should be subscribing to. And I wanna start off by saying that I haven't put these in any particular order. Just the first one is not my favorite. Um, the last one is not my least favorite. It's just the order that I'm putting them in. I will say though, I've been a little bit biased and I have put five Australian photography YouTubers in the list uh, out of the entire 10. So here I am, I'm going to be uh, honest with you, I'm, I'm gonna increase the subscriber count for the Aussies. Yeah, Aussie, 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 oi, oi, oi. That's what we're gonna do. So uh, the, the Aussies will get the mention of the last five. And the thing that did surprise me out of all the YouTubers that I follow and even looking at other vloggers, I couldn't find many uh, female photography vloggers. There is one on my list, and we will get to that very, very shortly. All right, so let's get started. As I said, in no particular order, but make sure that each of these vloggers or YouTube photography people, you go and you subscribe and let them know that Ben sent you and that you're hitting the subscribe button and sending them some YouTube love because that's what it's all about. All right, we're gonna start up in Northern Ireland uh, with a fellow called Stephen Hanna now. I have mentioned him before, giving him giving him a shout out before, not just here on YouTube, but also on my other social media channels. Uh, Stephen's a, a great guy, does some really cool landscape photography, is in an amazing spot up there in Northern Ireland. And, you know, I'm just oh, gobsmacked by the, 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 the beauty of the landscape that he gets to shoot. I will say that the guys that are up there, UK, Ireland, up that way, have to deal with some atrocious weather compared to what we do here, and I really admire that. I think there are times when I watch these guys up in that end of the uh, of the world struggling with the weather, I'd probably not even go out, or maybe I'd pack my gear up and go home. So well done, Stephen, I really love your vlog. Um, so head over. Now, by the way, the links to every one of their channels is down below in the description. So that's the easy way to go and find them. So Stephen Hanna, Northern Ireland. Um, the second one is from a similar part of the world, just nearby in the UK and that is Gary Goff. Now, once again, Gary has had a shout out on my channel before, and he has also, I think, uh, mentioned me on his channel before, so you may have heard of him. Uh, the thing I love about Gary is he got a good sense of humor, a great down-to-earth guy, very good photographer, and once again, going to some really nice locations. Uh, now, one of the things that he does say when you go across to his YouTube channel and you click on his About tab, is that he is very good looking. I'm gonna challenge him on that and I'm gonna let you be the judge. So go over there, hit subscribe on his channel. As I said, he does have a sense of humor, thank goodness. Uh, otherwise he may have taken offense to that. So head over there, hit subscribe and let him know that I sent you across there. All right, let's head to another UK one. Um, and this is Gareth Danks. Now I think Gareth is uh, one of those YouTubers that doesn't have as many subscribers as he deserves. He, his content's really good. Uh, his quality of his content's really good, audio is really good, the places he shoots is really good. I just think he's a, a great vlogger that needs a little bit more attention. So head across there. He's from South Wales, so down the southern end of the UK, and visits some amazing places. Uh, you know, they all seem to go to that popular lakes district, but certainly Gareth's uh, YouTube channel is one to be following. I think that you'll really enjoy it. All right, from the UK, let's head across to Canada. Um, to Adam Gibbs. Now, Adam is a uh, another guy with a bit of a sense of humor. Some of his videos have a little bit of comedy in them uh, in, in the way that he approaches things, but uh, great photographer, really good vlogger, once again, good content, and I think uh, a YouTuber that needs to be subscribed. You know, go and subscribe to his channel, go and check him out, loving what he's up to, and shoot some really uh, cool places. Adam Gibbs from Canada. Once again, all the links are down below. Uh, where did I get up to? All right, I'm looking at my list, by the way. I've got a list written out here. And this is that one uh, female vlogger that I was talking about. It's Rachel Lurch. Now, Rachel has been on a, a, a very driven path of creating a whole bunch of, uh, of content. Uh, it's gone crazy, developing amazing content, but is visiting some just amazing places. And it's interesting to see the contrast between our weather here in Australia as we head into summer and a lot of snow field landscapes right now for Rachel. So really enjoying that. 
and Rachel has good quality. Uh, uses a stabilizer for her vlogging camera, I think, because it's really smooth uh, video quality. So I think you'll enjoy what Rachel's up to. Go over there and check out her channel as well. Once again, let her know that I sent you, and I'm sure she'll be more than happy to have another subscriber. Okay, with the remaining five, so that's, I've done, yep, I think I've done the ones that I said I was gonna do outside of Australia. The remaining five are in Australia, and once again, in no particular order. Uh, and I'm gonna start off with one that is, it is likely you probably already know because we've done a fair few collaborations. Well, well, sorry, not a fair few collaborations. We've collaborated once, but I had mentioned him several times on my channel. And I know that a lot of the uh, subscribers to my channel subscribe to his channel, and that is Andrew Marr. Now, Andrew Marr is on the west coast of Australia. I'm on the east coast of Australia. Very different landscapes, great guy, very cinematic feel to his vlogs. And even his reviews are very cinematic. I, I uh, you know, only wish I could put that much time and energy. I, his, even his reviews are amazing to watch. So head across there. Uh, Andrew does some great vlogs and some great video work and I think highly entertaining content. So head over there and enjoy that. Whilst we're on the Andrews, uh, I'm gonna uh, give a shout out to another Andrew. This is my uh, seventh, I think I said, yep, seventh uh, uh, YouTuber that I think in particular, this guy needs more subscribers. He doesn't have as many subscribers as what I think he deserves, and that is Andrew Dawes. Now, Andrew Dawes is located in the Port Stephens area, which is sort of the uh, mid-north coast of New South Wales, about, I don't know, two and a half hours drive north of me, and he has traveled around a bit. In fact, you may have seen him in some of Andrew Marr's videos. They all went to Tassie together. Uh, earlier on this year and filmed a whole bunch of videos there as they were doing that. So go and check out Andrew's channel and once again hit the subscribe button. All right, uh, up in that same area is uh, Colin Stalker. Now Colin is not as regular and I don't mean that way, I mean with his video uploads. Uh, uh, but Colin is you know getting around up there in the Port Stephens area and especially for Aussie uh, photographers, if you're looking for someone to follow uh, that is local, Colin's a good down-to-earth Aussie guy that you can go and hit the subscribe button. Uh, once again, has nowhere near the amount of subscribers that he should have, and I think you could go and check out his channel. Once again, links down below. Send him some YouTube love. In fact, I think he's got under a thousand subscribers, so make sure you follow him. Um, and whilst I'm on vloggers uh, that I think have less than a thousand subscribers, I'm pretty sure this next guy does as well. Last time I looked. Uh, and I don't know why, because his content's really good, and that is Adam Dyson. Now, Adam Dyson is down in Victoria. Uh, I'm not sure exactly where he's from in Victoria. I think he lived in his van, or may still be living in a van full-time. Great photographer, lots of good reviews, tutorials, tips, and vlogs. Uh, and you can go and check out his channel as well. A big shout out to Adam, and I'm sure you'll enjoy his content. And my very final Aussie, I told you there was five Aussies. <laughs> We're gonna do some work to make Australia great again. Now that's Donald Trump saying, is it? Retract that, Australia's already great. Uh, let's look at uh, our 10th one, which is Ian Smithson. Now Ian is another Aussie guy, and I think when I first discovered Ian's channel, he was doing a 52 week challenge, and every week he was posting the photos that he was taking as he was doing the challenges on YouTube. And I've also now seen a few of his videos where he was on a trip to the UK. Uh, great guy, very, very uh, straightforward approach, explains to you exactly what he's doing, how he's shooting, and you know takes you through some different scenarios as he's shooting each of his pictures as well. And I think it's really helpful. Uh, so another channel that I enjoy watching. So there you go, 10 photography YouTubers that I think that you should be following. And of course, we're gonna be sharing some of the YouTube love. Go and hit the subscribe button and enjoy that. I'm sure you're going to enjoy watching their channels as well. And if you did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, if you enjoy this type of content and you want to see more. And of course, until next time, as I always say, get out there and take some photos.